Good morning guys, what's up and welcome back to another Co's Daily Brew. Today we're going to be talking about how atmosphere is everything. Um, you might actually notice that my atmosphere right now is a little different. I decided to change my room around today and it got me thinking about today's topic, hence why I figured we could dive in and have a little morning chat about it over morning coffee, um, to which, good morning. So atmosphere is everything and by that I mean I feel like we've talked about this like a lot via podcasts and in other videos but I feel like what we tend to surround ourselves with really does at least for me anyway I feel like it really sets the tone of our mood it sets the tone of how productive we are it sets the tone of whether we're basically evolving or you know staying the same or hopefully not but going backwards you know and I feel like that stems from the fact that everything that we tend to surround ourselves with is usually something that we've chosen to put in our lives. There's a reason why, you know, you hang pictures or tapestries and things on your wall. There's a reason why you choose to put the things you do on your nightside table. There's a reason why you wear the clothes you wear and there's a reason why the things that are visually around you tend to appeal to you. And a lot of the time we kind of take for granted that superpower because in a way, if you can use it to your advantage, it can become a superpower. Now, I feel like I'm a little oversensitive to my surroundings solely because I don't leave my house for work. Like I do my work here. So I find that it's made me very aware in the last few years how important it is to me to feel like my surroundings are inspiring and things that make me feel just good and motivated and like connected. And even if it's just as simple as like getting a plant and naming said plant, that plant becomes something that brings me joy when I'm just like hanging out in my room during the day or you know like come Sunday when it's time to water my plants I like play a nice little melody like instrumental jazz beat and water all my plants and that's just something that makes me feel really good and it's something that's in my immediate surroundings so that sparks my mood up a couple notches and that is why that can be such a superpower if you take into account what you just look around whatever room you're in right now if this is somewhere that you're you're you spend a lot of time and especially look around right now, but if you're somewhere that you're not like there all the time, then think about your bedroom at home and just think about the things that are in that room. Now pick out immediately in your mind or pick out immediately just looking around the things that make you feel the happiest, the things that you've put there for a reason. And then look around the room and see if there's anything that kind of sparks a not so joyful feeling, a not so like woohoo, but more of a stressor or something that might be making you feel like, you know, you've been procrastinating a pile in the room or whatever, whatever it is, just notice it. Just seeing the fluctuation in your mood from looking at the things that brought you joy to looking at the things that brought you stress. That is proof enough that our atmosphere can significantly change our moods. So, I mean, just using that to our advantage and I mean using it to my own advantage today, I moved around my room, I got rid of some stuff in my room that just was like added clutter and I'm slowly but surely um, starting my minimizing process. I'm hoping that by the time August rolls around, I can minimize a lot of my stuff in this room and I'm looking forward to like, I don't know, documenting it and sharing it with you guys, but it's also just made me aware of my atmosphere and like really putting purpose into why there's things around me all the time. So yeah, I don't know. That was my chat of the day. Let me know what you guys think. What are your favorite things in your general atmosphere? Uh, one of the things that I really enjoy about this new camera angle is you guys can see Arlo up there. Arlo? No. Hale, sorry, you guys can see Hale, that was horrible, I'm a really bad plant mom, the fact that I just forgot, um, and you guys can see just my like back, just my backdrop now, you know, just the little things in my room that bring me lots of joy, so atmosphere affects your mood, and when you surround yourself with a happy atmosphere, you are usually, odds are, happier and more inspired and more motivated, so... That's a little update. I would have done an updated room tour with you guys, but I literally feel like I do those every two months now. So I just ended up posting it to Instagram stories in case you guys wanted to see it. I'll leave my Insta down below. And aside from that, I'll talk to you guys all tomorrow morning. Bye guys.